This section explains how to perform non-invasive blood pressure, NBP, SpO2, and temperature measurements. After entering or selecting a patient ID, you can take vital signs measurements in any order. When performing NBP, the first step is to select the appropriate size cuff. A properly sized cuff should span approximately two-thirds of the distance between the elbow and the shoulder and wrap around the limb. Use of an improperly sized cuff can result in inaccurate blood pressure readings. Connect the cuff to the tubing and the tubing to the device. Press the NBP key on the front of the VSI to initiate a blood pressure measurement. Following deflation, the NBP measurement is displayed on the screen including systolic, diastolic, and mean arterial pressure. Use the up-down key to highlight the NBP numeric pane. Press select and the blood pressure menu appears. Here you can make changes to the initial inflation pressure and the NBP measurement units. When measuring SpO2, the most important consideration is to pick a sensor site with brisk arterial perfusion. It's also important to avoid using a limb with an NBP cuff. In a few moments, oxygen saturation and pulse rate numerics appear. If NBP is selected as the heart rate source, pulse rate will not appear. The perfusion indicator bar is a signal quality indicator for the SpO2 measurement. The next measurement is temperature. There are two modes for temperature measurements, monitored mode, which provides a continuous measurement, or predictive mode, which takes a single measurement. In predictive mode, after removing the probe from its holder, this icon appears, and a tone sounds, indicating the probe is ready for placement. Make sure that the correct probe site is selected. Be sure to attach a probe cover before placing the probe. The VSI measures the patient's temperature in approximately 4 seconds when measuring orally and approximately 16 seconds when measuring axillary or rectally. An audible tone indicates that the measurement is complete. Temperature is displayed here. In monitored mode, the VSI measures the patient's temperature continuously and displays the temperature in the numeric pane as long as the probe is in contact with the patient. It is recommended that the probe not stay in the mouth for more than three minutes. Highlight and select the temperature numeric pane to change probe site, switch between predictive and monitoring modes, and change temperature units.